welcome back to another video guys I'm going to be showing you this natural glam eye look today um, first off I've started with the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette I'm just going to take this kind of red orange shade and blend it all over my lid as a base colour once I've packed on all of the orange colour that I want I just go in with a clean fluffy brush so that the eyeshadow isn't too heavy and we're getting kind of a natural look and all I'm going to be doing is using this clean brush to blend out the colour I forgot to mention because I did it off camera but as a base for my eyeshadow I use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Eye Primer and for my brows I also use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow. I'm going to be packing on this purple colour from the 35M Morphe palette just to darken up the orange eyeshadow and to give it some depth. I'm kind of thinking about wanting to do a palette collection and just kind of explaining through all the palettes I've got. So if you guys would be interested in that, let me know because it's definitely one of the ideas I have. Again, I'm just going in with a clean fluffy brush to blend out everything so it doesn't look streaky. Blending is key guys and at the end that is when we'll like clean the edge of the eyeshadow so don't worry about the mess too much at the moment. Then I'm just going in with my Fenty Beauty Concealer to cut the crease as I always do. Do you guys ever get where you'll buy a concealer and it doesn't always sit right under your eyes? Don't get me wrong, Fenty Beauty Concealers are amazing but because I have quite dry skin, it just doesn't really stick with me well so it's just become my cut crease concealer now. I always use a flat round brush to do my cut creases, I just think it's the easiest thing to use. Then I'm just going to pack on this white shade from the James Charles palette just to set the concealer in place so it doesn't crease at all. Then I'm going in with this yellow shade from the Jaclyn Hill palette, I'm just going to pack that on the end of my lid just to add a bit more colour to the look. Then I'm just going in with a fluffy brush and a little bit of orange to blend that yellow colour into the rest of the eyeshadow. Where I've been blending I've lost a bit of the yellow shadow so I'm just going to apply that again with a flat packing brush. With the same brush I'm just going to apply this shimmer shade from the Jaclyn Hill palette, it's kind of an orangey gold and then over the top I'm going to go in with a gold shimmer from the 35M Morphe palette. I applied my lash off camera because they honestly take me forever to do. Um, and I also just wiped away all the fallout from underneath my eyes and kind of tidied up the ends of the shadow a bit. And then I'm going in with the same orange shade and just putting it on my bottom lash line. And the final step is mascara, just to blend my natural lashes into the false ones I'm wearing. The ones I'm wearing are from Morphe, they are called Chummy and they're in their like premium range and then I'm just going to squeeze my natural and the fake lashes together and this is the finished look I hope you enjoyed guys I do also always upload my videos on my Instagram as well but obviously just in a much shorter time frame so if you want to check that out I'll leave the links below and thanks for checking it out guys